book lovers. Um, today, my daughter got her Owl Crate Junior in the mail. Um, she doesn't want to do videos anymore because she thinks she's too good for it. She's a teenager. So I thought I would unbox this because I haven't seen very many up yet. So if you want to see what's in here, it's January 2018, so this does have spoilers. So let's see what's in the box. Alright, here's what it looks like. And this is the spoiler card. It's sugar and spice for January. All right, let's see what we got in here. Oh, this is cute. I think she might actually like that. This is some um, macaroons, six vanilla scented erasers. That's really cute. Look at how colorful those are. Those are super cute. I hope she likes those. Those are really cute. Okay. Let's see what the next thing is. Oh, this is cute. It's like a little rolling pin. I wonder if she'll actually bake with me having this stuff. Oh, and this is really cool. This is from the bake shop on Etsy. It also gives you a promo code to use if you want to get some, but like it's like all different kinds of sprinkles. That's really cool. Alright, the next thing I see is a cookie cutter. And it kind of looks like the Coco stuff. I haven't seen that movie yet, but that's really cool. Day of the Dead, Candy Skulls. And the next thing I see is Itsy Bitsy Super Cute Stickers. That's cute. She better keep that away from her younger sister. She'll take those apart. <laughs> and this... Looks like it might be an apron. Oh, that's super cute. It is a little apron. That's got the little owl on it. That's super cute. Alrighty. Oh, here's the pin. It's a little cupcake that says yum. That's cute. And the next box will be Wild Magic. And my daughter loves these boxes. I think she'll enjoy this stuff. She either enjoys it or she gives it to her friends or teachers at school. And then um, the book is Love, Sugar, Magic, A Dash of Trouble. Ooh, that looks really cool. And then it looks like, I don't want to open it because it's hers. But it looks like it has a signed book plate, and it looks like it has a recipe for probably one of the items in the book. And then it also has a letter from the author. So that's really cool. Now I'm going to have to put all this back for her. But yeah, she doesn't want to do any of the videos, so I, I'm doing it for her. Um, Let's find the spoiler card here. Oh, here it is. Ah, sorry. I lost it. Okay, spoiler card. Put on your apron and break out your rolling pin and time to bake up some magic. Sugar skulls, which I thought was a sugar skull. And I can't read the other part because it's in kind of like a Spanish. Dia de los Mortos. I do know that. Learn all about the celebration in this month's book and then make your own sugar skull cookies with your cool new cookie cutter. When you're finished, put some sprinkles on there. And then vanilla scented macaron erasers will gobble up mistakes in the blink of an eye. Speaking of eyes, these sweet stickers bring a whole new meaning to seafood. Ha, <laughs> cute. As the youngest of five girls, Leona is tired of hearing she is too little to help. So when she discovers a magical family secret, she decides to take things into her own hands. Love, Sugar, Magic is the first in a charming and funny new series from Anna Marina, Mer, Marano, all about family baking and, of course, magic. This month's book comes with a letter and signed book plate from the author, plus a recipe for the Dia de los Muertos specialty, Bread of the Dead. And the items are created by Alcrate Jr., Fred and Friends, Sweetest Thing Bake Shop, Ole Little Brown. So that is Alcrate Jr. for January. Very cute. 
All right, thanks for watching. Bye.